Corvallis has some hidden gems as far as eating goes, and my favorite place for breakfast is definitely Broken Yolk. And I actually went to Broken Yolk on my recruiting trip, and I feel like that's part of the reason why I came here, because it's so delicious. And so I'll always go there on like a Saturday or Sunday morning, and it's really yummy. The best food on campus is Bing's, and it's actually really close, and it's within the residence halls, so you can get a really good sandwich there and customize it and make it yourself. And then I also like to get food right outside the gym at the library, Java. And you know, I always get my protein bar or something like that, so I have energy for gym. The best off-campus food is anywhere on Monroe. They have Local Boys, which is amazing. And then they also have McMinmins, which I really like. And then Cafe Yum, which is really good. Corvallis is such a college-based town, and so all the restaurants really target the student and their needs and their pricing and stuff like that, so there are so many great places in Corvallis. I love, love, love Subway. Um, their tuna flatbread sandwiches are one of my favorites. Um, I'm very fond of local boys. Their chicken and ribs and steak are, are great. Um, big proportions too. And I think another one of my favorites has got to be Ruby Tuesdays. And I think that's because as a freshman, after every meet, we used to go there as a team um, after. And I think that just kind of made Ruby's just kind of a special place. Um, they're always really accommodating. After a meet, you can ring up and say, hey, we've got 40 plus people coming in and they'll have all these tables ready for you when you come in. So I think Ruby's is one of my favorites. And you know, restaurants are always popping up here and there. I love Tokyo Steakhouse. I love the sushi. I'm a huge sushi fan. Although in Australia, like sushi isn't just seafood. And so, in Australia, my favorite is chicken teriyaki sushi. And when I came here to America, I was like, hey, do you have chicken teriyaki sushi? And these people look at me like, uh, no, it, it's just seafood. No. You know, so, um, now I've, I've very much adapted to the sushi. Tokyo has really fresh, fresh, tasty sushi. My favorite place to study is actually another hidden gem. It's at Fred Meyer on the second level and they have a little Starbucks there. And it's usually not busy because it's the second level. And you know, I can focus, they have free internet and power outlets. And then if I'm needing a kind of a break or something like that, I can just look over the balcony and watch people shop because I'm a big people watcher. So that's always good for me. You know, I'm really easily distracted. Um, so if I have to go somewhere to study, it'll have to be the library. Um, either with a group study, because you know, they get the input of other people, otherwise just by myself. Like if I'm at home, I get distracted by what's in the fridge or what's on TV. Um, another really great place is in Gill Coliseum. Um, we have a student kind of computer lab up there and it's free printing for all student athletes. So. Whereas at the library, they charge you onto your account. So, you know, one of those two will, will help me get the work done.